Good morning. We are taking the boat this morning, the 18 foot flats boat from Panama City to Apalachicola. We just launched. Hal's uh, parking the trailer and I'm just waiting for him and uh, we'll be gone. I already have my sweater on and my favorite sweatpants, my hay fork sweatpants and I've got my Nutella bar and I've got my blanket because it is not warm yet. It's not even close. Alright, so we were like drifting for a few minutes and then I sort of like drove us off into the bayou because uh, there were no more channel markers and I did recognize that but then I, I don't know how I was saying go and I was like, I don't see any channel markers down here and he said, just stay in the middle. And I was like, okay. And then he's like, turn around. But yeah, uh, it tightens up up here, it gets real pretty and we're kind of like on the back side of Mexico Beach. I got my little thing on because I got to keep my ears covered because they get really messed up. But um, all right, next stop is White City. We made it to White City and uh, feeling a little wind blown. It's a nice day though. It's a good day for this. Really good day for this. It's just about 20 degrees warm. All right, y'all. This woman is scaring the hell out of me. I, I should have never let her drive the boat. Why? I don't think that we're gonna make it out alive. Shut up. She she keeps like just yelling at boats, and they got the right of way. I'm not yelling at anybody. Shut up. The no, worst I'm not. road rage I've ever seen. Water <laughs> rage. It is horrible. That's not true. None of that is happening. The, if, if y'all see this, none of that we made is happening. Through. None of that is happening. Anyway, these are our old stomping grounds. We used to come tubing up here. And high... Did you ever come tubing up here? In yeah, school? yeah. I was the one bringing people to tube up here well, sometimes. I used to Savannah come up here. Died, right? I, I used to come up here tubing with Savannah. Yeah, I, they were jumping into the water and she didn't come up. And then I guess divers found her tucked under a log. That's the story I got. Divers found her tucked under a log. An alligator got her. No shit. Like just jumping in, jumping in the water. Gator got her. It's amazing, like when you're just playing in the water. Like we grew up here, you know, and like I've I've been swimming in some 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 water that had, that probably people not from here would not swim in, and felt totally comfortable doing it because like gators get out of the way, right? Not always, they don't. Where are we going? Right over here. What for? You see something? I do. What do you see? I see a thing. What do you see? see. I don't see anything. What's going on? What are we doing? Oh.
Okay, you guys, we made it. And uh, we're here at the city dock. It's the newer city dock. It's like, it's, I don't know. It's, it's really not new. <laughs> I just, uh, this is my hometown. So um, it feels new to me. You know, it's like been here for probably 15 years. Uh, yeah, here we go. Welcome to Appalachia. I can't get past all the tourists. Ay -ay. No, I mean, I can physically get past the tourists. Not mentally. I mean, mentally, I. Oh. What, what the. I'm going to one of my favorite spots, the soda fountain. It's been my favorite place since I was like a little kid. I love a good root beer float at the soda fountain. That one's good. So everything in Appalachia is like totally just different. Like this isn't like the grill that we know and love, but um, we're here nevertheless. <laughs> this was a world famous grill. It was, it was never world famous. Bullshit, it was in Newley's Gold. It was, was in Newley's Gold. I stood, and all that stuff. I stood across the street over there where we just were and came out of the, um, the soda fountain and watch them film Yuli's Gold like right here. Like our car is in the movie. <laughs> <laughs> so we ate and uh, we had a great debate about how far away the 10 foot hole was. And I said, it's three blocks. And he said, it's five or six. It's three blocks. I'm sticking with that. It's, it's three blocks. Block, block and a half. Let's go see John Gorey. Come on. We can buy the coolest shirt in town. Come on. Uh, no, well, I'm sure they're closed. They're always closed. I bet they're not. It's Memorial Day. But we Day. can go to his cemetery. We can go to the cemetery on the hill if you want to. No, no. Well, oh. That's the I cemetery. I like that cemetery. I used to hang out in that cemetery all the time when I was a kid. The hill cemetery? I had, like, friends in there. They were dead. No, but for real, like, there was, there was a gravestone in that place that was, like, up toward the front. And, like, half of it was broken, like, sideways like this. And I was like, it's got to be here somewhere. I found that thing. It took me like half a year to find it. But I found the other half of that thing half buried in the back of the cemetery. And I came back and I put it on the, the, the where it was supposed to be. One of the things I love about Appalach is all of the magnolia trees. We have so many magnolia trees like in this, on this side of town. This is like one of the historic neighborhoods. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
our beautiful Episcopal Church. I'm not Episcopalian, but um, I've always liked the church and I've been there several times. I did the thing where they give you wine and bread. What's that called where they give you wine and bread? The Lord's Supper. Oh. Well, whatever it is. And I went <laughs> to the, because I, I was Baptist. Communion, whatever. I was Baptist. So when they did it in the Baptist church, it was like Welch's grape juice. When I did it in the Episcopal church, it was not Welch's grape juice. <laughs> And the preacher like pours it in your mouth like the Catholics do. So we're getting back on the boat now and we're going to go see some family and uh, head back. Okay, so we got out of Appalachia and we went through Lake Wimico and now we are in just a little a little loop off the intercoastal and it's really pretty here. As you can see, we have some cypress trees and it's really deep, like right over there. It's like 30 feet deep or something. Yeah, we thought that we would take this moment to introduce you to today's sponsor, which is, give me that. Moon pies. Moon pies. <laughs> it's it's called Puffin. We bought RC Colas because we just thought it was nostalgic. We love these. We didn't. We couldn't find the moon pies. Uh, so I found these at um, uh, West Marine. The guy at the counter, I had to touch everything. Because you know when you go to West Marine, you have to touch everything. And the guy was like, here, touch this. <laughs> <laughs> and he handed me one of these. Straight and I was up. like, I need <laughs> that. So we have that now. And they're they're from a company called Puffin. And we are giving you guys a discount code. If you want to buy them for your boat, there's a discount code right here. I'm an astronaut out. Yeah, they got an astronaut. I really wanted that. I almost got that. And I was like, well, we're boat people. So let's just, I just thought for, for my life right now, two, two life jacket koozies would be great. I wonder if they float. Do you think they float? Should we, yeah, should we put one of these in the water? Don't put your brand new koozie in the water. Oh, come on, let me. All right. You want me to do it or are you going to do it? Are we going to do it? Do <laughs> you want to put it in there? Let's see if they're actual life preservers. You need to... Strap my RC in there real mm, good now. Yeah. Don't right. let it sink. Baby boy. Yes, they're oh actual life preservers. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! So you won't lose your beer. Wow. So that's actually kind of really cool. That's so cool. <laughs> But I do not suggest drinking canal water. So. Oh, I'm sure it was fine. No. <laughs> I'm an 80s baby, okay? Like, I can handle anything. Anyway, I have my wet koozie now. But yeah, it floats. I'm so glad we did that. <laughs> we stay in there too long, we'll know somebody. Yeah, that's true. Whether we want to or not, <laughs> mm -hmm. we will know them. Yeah. Or maybe we might have known we don't know more.
right, you guys, I just got the boat on the trailer, house here, and I guess this concludes this great adventure. She did kill me. She drove the whole way there and most but of the way why would I kill back, you? And she didn't kill me. She yelled at a bunch of people. It was insane. No, I did not. Look, it was insane. I haven't yelled at anybody. This is not my first day driving a boat. He's just trying to make yeah. me out to be something. On the water issue. Oh, you know, the kayaker, poor kayaker guy just trying to enjoy his weekend. You blew by them. It's the law. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, um, I don't know. I hope that you had as much fun as we did. Probably not. <laughs> I suggest it. If you're in Panama City, you got a boat, take it to Apple App. It's an all day yeah. event, but it's worth it. That was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. All right. Destin. Yeah, we should go to Destin next. All right. All right. Bye, you guys. Don't trust this. Just jump down. You're a goddamn athlete. Ah. Here, come here. Ah. Ah. You should, why aren't we filming this? We are. <laughs> <laughs>